Hello my loves, how y'all doing? Hope you guys are doing well. I keep saying I'm not gonna use this intro for this channel, but I don't know. I keep forgetting. Guys, if you're new here to this channel, I have another channel called Cypher Beauty. Maybe I should speak louder. I have another channel called Cypher Beauty and that's the intro. Okay, I'm sorry. I need to change it. Guys, hello guys. I kind of did a little bit of makeup just so that I don't look so tired and you know. I'm so sorry for all the noise. Okay, so I hope we won't have so much noise. Anyways, guys, I thought today I'd come back here to this channel and talk about my favorites. Oh my god, it's a busy house today, okay? So yeah, okay, let's continue. Sorry, we have a, ran a bit of random favorites that I've been loving and I just want to talk to you guys about it because I think you guys need some of this stuff. Okay, okay. Um, it's mainly skincare and some body care or yeah, stuff like that. Just nothing specific, it's not makeup, and let's just continue on with the first thing. So the first thing we're going to be talking about is this face wash, but it's kind of a scrub. It gently exfoliates and helps purify skin. This is a face scrub, basically, from Kills. I do love, love, love this company. It makes just amazing thing. They're kind of natural. It smells like um, a spa. Did I just put my whole face in there? My nose and everything. It smells like a spa. It's... um. The particles are quite small, minor, they don't really hurt you. Just go gently with your face. I don't use a lot of scrubs. This is the only scrub that I do use. It's very gentle, which is very important to me. It has some citric acid, some salicylic acid to help with the pimples and the clarity of your skin. It works amazing. I use this a lot, especially um, at night when I'm trying to remove like uh, SPF and also, also whenever I come back from the worst review makeup artist in my city. Yeah. I kind of scrub my face with this because I really want to get it all off. This is amazing. And you know what? Funny story. I kind of lost this. It went, it fell down behind my toilet seat. And I didn't notice. I didn't notice. I forgot about it. And then one day I was just scrolling through Instagram and I was like, where is this? Where is this? Why do I see? Did someone take it? Then I went to the toilet and started looking for it and looking for it everywhere. All the cupboards. And then I found it behind the toilet seat. And I was like, yay, thank God. I love this, okay? I lost it for like a week and I completely didn't notice it wasn't there. I think I, I looked for it. I didn't find it. I just grabbed anything else that was in front of me. And because I have like a bunch of uh, face washes there, I just kind of just, you know, took the next best thing for removing everything. It's not a scrub, but it's just as good as cleaning your face. And this is from a company called CVR. So the next thing we're going to be talking about is this from CVR. I actually don't know much about this brand at all, but this is for oily and sensitive skin and it's tested on acne prone skin. Amazing. 200 ml, which I love. I love a big bottle. Okay. Now this is really good at cleaning your face. It cleans your face really, 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 really squeaky clean, but it doesn't dry your skin out. So I've been loving this as well. Let me read more about what's in here. Um, uh, what do we have? Glycerin that helps make it, you know, um, not drying on your face. Oh, it is. this does have parfum. So it has a little bit of perfume, which is not very... It smells great. It makes you feel nice and fresh. It smells really fresh, but it's not very great for sensitive skin. But it hasn't been giving me any kind of problems. So if your skin is not that sensitive to smell, it won't be a problem. But it does clean your face really well. It's purifying. It's exfoliating. Okay? It's great. I love this so much. If you know much more about it, let me know down below if you've used many of these products because I haven't. I haven't used much from this line, but I've been loving it, okay? It's nice for oily skin and it's not drying, which is great because sometimes you get those oily skin um, cleansers and they're so drying and that's not what we're looking for exactly, okay? It's not. Um, the next thing, this is like an honorable mention, it's nearly gone, like I have... A tiny bit of that left so I did want to talk to you about it uh, don't worry about this marks that it has it's clean I swear it's clean but uh, my um, house has salt water it has salt water it stains everything so even plastic stains but this is from Bath and Body Works I just love the way this smells oh, I love this this is a black cherry Merlot there's nothing much to say about it it's nice and cleansing it's nice for your hands it cleanses your hands very well but it's not drying it has essential oils in here so it's not drying at all and it's really just 
lovely to use it's like a lot of foam it comes out with like a lot of foam i don't want to remove it but you know those hand washes just foam up it's not like a liquid that comes out it's like a foam love it so yeah this is about to finish it's about to go on my empty soon adore it adore the way it smells anyway your hands smell the last thing that we can talk about that okay shit two more two more stuff then we'll go into like the skincare i've been using on my face two more stuff that i've been loving in the bathroom this is a johnson johnson's vitamin rich replenishing body wash with a raspberry extract this just smells amazing feels amazing on your skin cleanses well non drying again i don't look for anything drying your whole toilet smells good when you're done it smells really sweet if you're into like raspberry and berry scents then you might enjoy this very much it's from johnson johnson i this is actually my second bottle and i love it so much i got it from bahrain when i was there so after i'm done with it i don't know where i'm gonna find it but i will look for it okay it must be here somewhere it must be here next what we use for our hair okay i am gonna mention skincare at the end and maybe some perfume something i've been using a lot this month okay this one is a manuka hair manuka honey and marufa oil intensive hydration conditioner with fig extract and baobab oil it's hide it hydrates and replenishes dry damaged hair sulfur free and color safe this is from the company shia moisture i know if you guys are like a natural if any of you guys are like into the natural hair thing the curly hair thing the curly hair methods and all that you will definitely know about shia moisture it's one of the most famous companies i think when it comes to natural hair or even just hair in general i've heard about this for i've used this for a really long time years and years and years but this actual this actual bottle this is my first time using the manuka honey and marufa oil i believe i've used the other conditioners i love this so so much if your hair is dry curly brittle sometimes gets really dry gets really dry it's very curly you need this i love this so much it's so good and uh, you can even use it when your hair is straight like my husband uses it and his hair is bon 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 straight but he just uses a tiny bit i use a lot okay he uses it gets his hair nice and shiny and black it gets my hair nice and shiny and black and curly and looks juicy on top of that i do add an oil i did not bring it with me here but um if you have curly hair make sure you seal the conditioner okay so yeah this is sheer moisture babies love it i bought it here in tanzania in shoppers plaza there's like a shop outside they sell these these are very expensive here in tanzania i know they're not that expensive in uh, usa okay but in here in tanzania this was like fifty thousand. was it like fifty thousand? i think so very expensive doesn't have to be that expensive please okay next let's go on to some skin care babies this um yuja niacin yuja niacin blemish care serum it has a uh, niacinamide five percent and yuja extract 82.3 percent this yuja extract is supposed to be the vit vitamin c in here everything in here is written in korea koreans by some by me this is a company called some by me another very famous very famous korean company brand i love so many things from here from this line the thing i've used the most is the aha and bha this is actually an empty i just wanted to mention it because i love it so so much but it's finished it's like a jelly kind of moisturizer oh i cleaned it like cleaned it dry okay dry <laughs> there's not even a dot in there to show you guys you can just feel it feels really amazing oh my god and it's an ha bha so it uh exfoliates the skin it makes your skin so smooth so lovely oh my god i brought the i got the whole set of this it has like a serum uh toner which i don't use that much i know it works but i don't use it that much um a serum a toner soap even the soap is really good but it can be a little bit drying okay so be careful about that it's like a bar soap i love this this is my favorite from the line and the serum but now that i'm not using that i actually uh, got this from my sister it didn't work for her she had a problem with acne she's not sure what exactly gave her the acne so she was just kind of not using her products so because she wasn't using it she was like just try it out so try it out and see if it works for you and i did because i had like i had like 
scars from pimples that I got a few two months ago three months ago I got a lot of scars right over here so I started using this especially on that area to try and remove the scars and it's worked amazing I think it's been like two weeks if you guys are on the other channel I know you know if you guys are on the other channel I know you know when I mentioned it but I'm not sure when if I go check on the video if I go look for that video and uh, look at the dates then I'll know exactly how much how long I've been using this but in my head I'd say like three weeks and it's worked amazing the color the pigmentation on my skin is reducing so well I just have like a few dark spots but the rest it was like full it was full so if you guys see me a lot without makeup so you guys know I know you guys know okay you guys see me a lot without makeup before I go to the worst makeup artist video so you know the scars that I have and check them out in like three weeks ago and the latest video massive massive improvement and I owe it all to this because this is the only thing I've been using I've been trying to test this out and see if it's gonna work on my pigmented areas and it does and my whole face looks nice and bright it's gorgeous 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 okay so yeah loving that if you have a sensitivity to smell this does smell like it does smell like um, lemons and stuff. It does smell citrusy. So, be warned. Be warned. This is a sunscreen. This is also from a very new company for me. This is Hel Helio Care 360 Fluid Cream. Uh, SPF 50, very high protection, UVA and UVB, okay? And heavies and IRA okay so this is gorgeous gorgeous this color let me show you the back here i know it's dirty because i don't want to open it it's kind of messy because okay i'll just open it it's kind of messy because it comes in a tube like that as you guys can see the color on top of that is is um i'll have to try this out so i can show you it looks like a little bit of a foundation shade okay some people for some people it's like their perfect shade i think for me it's not my perfect shade but it's not exactly white it kind of uh disappears but it kind of makes your your whole face look nice and smooth can you guys see that it's disappearing but it does bring a little bit of a pigment because it is a tiny bit pigmented it's just not white pigment so it doesn't make you look ghostly or anything look at that just disappearing it doesn't make you look ghostly or anything but it does give you some glow and I don't know it's not exactly pigmented I can't say it's gonna make your skin look one color or even things out but it adds a little something okay just a little something that makes you look a little bit better okay That's awesome. beautiful beautiful sunscreen from Helio care um, I hate that this tube is just it's just like a 30 ml 50 ml it's like a 50 ml it's like a 50 ml but it, it's it's great i love this so much i have been using this a lot this month and yeah that's the sunscreen heliocare by heliocare 360 especially if you're using some kind of vitamin c please do not forget to use your sunscreen and use a lot okay enough on your face the last skincare product that i'm going to mention this month that i've loved this month is this one from clinique moisture surge i know so many people know clinique moisture surge this says it's a hundred hours ultra replenish hydrator as on hydrator a hundred hours it's great okay there's not much to say about it it's great it moisturizes your skin it doesn't have a scent it smells quite clean not clean perfumey but just clean it's really moisturizing it gets my face moisturized all the way to the morning i don't feel dry i don't feel it's it's great i don't know what else i can tell you because this is one of those basic moisturizers where it's just there to moisturize your face it doesn't have any exfoliators it doesn't have like anything special salicylic acid or abhas or anything it's just a clean smell clean moisturizer which i love especially since i got those pimples that's why uh, I've been keeping my skincare very simple I've been just um, vitamin C moisturizer SPF the face washes nothing else I use nothing else because I'm not trying to aggravate my skin anymore I just wanted to clear it out clear those pimples and keep it very simple guys whenever I feel like my skin is going through it some people uh, decide to like try everything trying to fix everything I don't I take a step back I'm like okay 
let's keep my skincare very simple right now so that everything just clears out and uh, it's not too much on my face so as I've been trying to do that in the past two months I've kept my skincare very simple I use another moisturizer but it's not here to love it too very simple also nothing much to it it's not like the it's not like this okay it's not that this is bad but this is you know something you know something this is HA and BHA is miracle cream so I've just been keeping my moisturizer clean basic just to moisturize nothing else okay honorable mention I think I'm gonna mention two um, scents that I've been just loving this month um, this is one from Victor and Rolf I think this smells like me I think this is what I want I want to smell naturally okay I love it it's just so me so girly so sweet not too sweet actually just not glowing sweet just sweet sweet person like I imagine a sweet bubbly very kind very down-to-earth person that's why I imagine I imagine someone wearing this I don't know that's just in my head I love it so much it comforts me it makes me feel clean it makes me feel girly it makes me feel sophisticated it makes me feel very comfortable okay so I've been using this like crazy this has been with me this is a new bottle by the way guys but look at that dent I just can't help it I can't help it I can't help it I love it so much if I could wear this like every day I think this is like a signature worth worth perfume like you can wear this every day and feel beautiful and feel like you and everything smells like you I love this okay so I've been using this for the past month like crazy and it it you can tell you can tell because this bottle is just like a month old two months old yeah, this bottle is like two months old and I adore it. One more that I've been loving that is new to me also, this is Coco Mademoiselle Intense. Now to me, this Chanel is also an everyday scent. If I want to smell clean, but sweet, sophisticated, I feel confident. If I want to feel confident, it makes me feel confident, sweet. I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing in life. Boss lady. Okay, I love it. So I wear this to the gym too because <laughs> it has this freshness to it it's it's like a burst of citrus first and then it stops to the end like patchouli and vanilla and it smells just amazing so this is like an everyday anytime scent you can go with it to the gym you can go with it to a lunch it's like a daily thing for me it's daytime appropriate but it also is nighttime appropriate so I have been <laughs> I have been yeah loving that you can see the dent i love to see the dent so yeah those two are gonna be my and my last things to talk about today i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe and let me know your thoughts down below this was a very chilled let's sit down and talk kind of video i hope you guys enjoyed it bye